Hi everyone, we get to show you how to make fake barn wood. You can buy in the store, of course a lot of money, but there's a few ways we can do it. There's actually a million ways you can do it, but I'm going to just show you my quick way and save you a lot of money and it also looks very nice. You can use any kind of wood. These are actually planks that I bought at Lowe's. Six foot planks for $1.87 about. But you could also buy uh, pine. That's another cheap kind of wood, soft wood. Or some people use uh, pallet wood. That's a little, a little too small for my taste. Anyway, so I'm gonna show you a few quick ways we could do it. And I'm gonna show you a finished product. Um, I like to use this drill and has this wiry kind of bit at the end. And what I do is I wanna get these grooves. I wanna show the veins of the wood and bring that out because it's nice and flat. But what I do is I hold it real tight and I get in here, I grind it out. That's one method as we do it. Okay, and then what I'll also do, quick unplug. Sometimes we'll do a little circular saw scraping. Well, Dave's just gotta be very careful. Mostly use glasses too, but I'm not. So anyway, I'll do a little scraping here. A nice little cut in there too. And then, We'll do a few wormholes. All right, we'll pop a few wormholes in here. Get that nice in there. Maybe a little bigger. You can use a nail, a screw. Okay. And sometimes I like to get a little artsy. Take a screw, hammer it, hammer it right in there. Maybe a little angle. A few little screw looks. And last but not least, you can use any kind of saw. I like to finish some rough edges. Okay, gives you a little bit of an idea of what we do. But to finish, we use the torch. And I'll show you what we do with the torch. What we do is go right on it, nice back and forth. Brings out the wood. The staining, you'll see how that's going to come out. There we go. A little better. You can start to see the wood pop, if you will. So I'm doing it. This is actually very quick that I'm doing. Getting the grooves there. So it's not a flat piece of wood. You can see how that grain comes out. And you can be as creative as you want. I'm gonna shut this off for a second. Let me show you a finished product. We're using a stain. Uh, you can use a cabin, a valve spar, whatever you like. And this is, we're gonna choose a bluish gray. But as you can see, you put the stain, we'll do a wipe. But you can see where I burn and marks, give it that old feel. And you can do the grooves as deep as you want. So from taking a piece of wood that's flat to complete your barn wood project for the back of any wall or any room and save yourself a lot of money.